Hi, my name is Nitya Sharma and my name is Neeti Sharma. Today we will be presenting a few of our visual art pieces inspired by our culture and background, which is India. First of all, let's introduce ourselves. We both are 14 years old and currently attend Mayfield Secondary School for the music program, where we play the flute. Along with music, we are passionate about visual arts and are excited to share our work with all of you. We specifically enjoy drawing using zentangles and paintings using the abstract art form. We get our inspiration from monuments from all over the world, people and animals, and we try to express their beauty and personality in creative ways. We also get most of our inspiration from visiting different parts of India where we discover different kinds of art forms. Firstly, we have an abstract painting of Radha Krishna. This painting shows Lord Krishna and Radha Rani, which are some of the many Hindu gods that are worshipped by people in our culture. Next, we have another painting that depicts the image of Lord Krishna as well. This is done in a realistic art style and uses a variety of colors inspired by flowers. Here we have a drawing of an elephant using an Indian art form called Madhubani. This style can be seen in eastern India in parts of Bihar and is unique because it uses a variety of tools including natural dyes, twigs and more. Next, we have a drawing of the Taj Mahal, a very famous monument located in the Agra district of Uttar Pradesh, India. To do this drawing, we use the Zentangle and Mandela art form, which is a beautiful form that is created in different ways all throughout the world. We use the same style in this drawing, which is of a peacock feather. Peacocks are the national bird of India, as they are an important part of Indian traditions and history. Lastly, we have a sketch of the India Gate. The India Gate is situated in New Delhi, which is where we are from. Here's a collection of some of our other artworks. 